All right, guys, welcome back to Vote Plays Final Fantasy 2, and in this one, playing Final Fantasy 2. But anyways, we just freed uh, Princess Hilda, and now we're just trying to get the hell out of here. So yeah. Also, if you don't know what Vote is, uh, that's the forum we're actually going to be discussing the Let's Play on. So what we're going to do is we're going to... Um, at the end of the month, we're going to start discussing this, uh, what we liked about the game, what we didn't like about the game, things like that. Um, and then, yeah, you're definitely welcome to participate. And if you didn't participate in this month's Vote Plays Final Fantasy, you can always do it next month. Like, it's open. Like, you can join in on one month and just not do any of the other months. Preferably, you do all the months. It's like, it's whatever, like, you want to do, you know? It's like a drop-in, do whatever you want kind of situation. But, yeah. Should be fun, and right now we actually got to get out of here and head back to Altair because Hilda was rescued. We don't need to be here anymore and encounter random captains that are going to destroy our lives. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, I was waiting for her to do something like really cool, like kill him, and then she did. So it was uh, kind of a disappointing wait for it there. What did he just cast? Sleep? Oh, that's... Eh, whatever. It's not too bad of a big of a deal because, like, look, he's already up and he's dead, so... If it doesn't attack, like, more than half my party, I'm not too worried. Or if it attacks, like, Furion and Gust, then I'm like, eh, please don't ever do that again. Anyways, looks like it's pretty easy to get out of here. And we just gotta head back to Altair. here. So our boat should be on the southern end, and then we can just start heading west. Perfect. And then these guys, I mean, they're not... Like, we can one-hit them. Um, obviously, Furion had a little bit of bad luck there, but they're not super dangerous. Like, nothing here will kill us. Most likely. I haven't done extensive exploration of the desert, so maybe we're gonna like encounter some rare creature that murders us immediately, like Final Fantasy X-2. But I doubt it. And once Fearon hits, that's it. He's done. No way you can survive that. This has got like super like HP or something, but that rarely happens. And Gus has got that spear skill up, that's awesome. It's kinda good they have proficiencies, so it's like Gus's spears, Ferion's sword, um Maria of course's bows. Like they don't switch off those, so they're like super adept at those. Therefore, they do more damage with them because I think they have like a higher attack rate, like 10 hit like that. I believe that's the whole thing, like more hits or stuff. I think when we get to Final Fantasy 12, I know it's a little bit early to talk about that, but I think I'm going to train Vaughn in, I don't know. I don't know if I want Vaughn to be my main character because normally he is because of the way I do it. Like I normally train him up to like a really high level and then everyone else is a high level. I think I'll do, um, I don't know, we'll discuss that more when we get to it, but I don't, I think I will definitely not do Vaughn, because I always do him. If you don't know what I'm talking about, Vaughn is the main, actually I wouldn't even say main character of Final Fantasy XII, he is the starting character of Final Fantasy XII, you start with him, um, and then you get other characters, you can control any one of them, so it's up to you. I think I've done Fran, Fran before. And Bosch. Hmm. Probably Balthier. Balthier will probably be the guy I control. I don't know. Because I want my main character to do bows. And that's not going to work for him because it just doesn't fit his theme. If that makes sense. Evasion's up. Evasion's definitely crucial.
to these normal fights. Uh, when we start getting bosses that cast spells, it doesn't really matter how much evasion we have. We're going to get hit regardless. But for these ones, it's kind of nice. Looks like Gus is able to take it out by himself. He's a big boy now. So we should be going the right way. Yep, tall tight here. We're perfect. Are we still good? I guess, yeah, it's a little bit far. I don't know why I thought it would be shorter. And now we can go talk to Hilda and see what's going on. Because I'm sure there's another mission. Oh. Never mind then. Please tell me we still have people here. Oh, thank God. Okay. That would have been horrible if we didn't have anyone in the inn, right? Well, not horrible. I could use Gatria, but... I prefer to use this area. I like how our rebel forces literally just consist of me doing all the fighting. Like, like you're having four children just beat the shit out of an empire. Like, that doesn't even make sense. All right, we'll do... What? Dude, screw you, game. All right, I will make my inventory as empty as you need it to be. Yeah, I bought these in error. I did not need these. Uh, 2500, that's a lot of gill, but I don't need any gill, so I'll keep a phoenix down. Just in case. Here's Toad, Stone, Curse, Amnesia. Mm. I don't need that much garlic. I actually probably don't even need these. Um. Yeah, I don't, I don't need these, stupid stone things. Like, they're not good. I'm never going to use them because I don't equip things. And I'll probably buy these later. The main idea is... 26. That's perfect. As many as we can fit, right? What does he sell? He sells... Yeah, he sells the expensive stuff. <laughs> Just get a bunch of elixirs. That would be the, that would be the life, right? Just waste our gill on that because we're at a low enough level right now where it's like high potions are fine elixirs probably never gonna need them but you know who knows maybe you know in a in another world maybe how far how long has it been since we actually saved this game Pelamessia. i think i did it yeah i did it before i entered the coliseum right maybe i don't even know Uh, it's just wonderful to see how like how much I brutalize these enemies. <laughs> just like, yeah, get out of my way. This isn't this isn't the place for you. This looks like a campsite. Look at all these guys. But wait. Okay, this doesn't even make sense because why are these guys so powerful and I can't even touch these enemies? Okay, well, let's talk. Uh, talk to Gordon. What do you got to say, buddy? Oh my gosh. You're going to make me go by myself? Do you not know what I'm talking about? What do you want to know about? Airship? Dreadnought? Maybe? Mithril? Wild Rose? 
Oh, okay. <laughs> it's just like, it's an imposter again. Okay, I guess. There has to be a reason we're able to do that to her. Oh well, shit happens. I'm probably missing something. Maybe it was the wild rose thing. It's like, it's supposed to be like an Easter egg sort of situation. Where it's like, oh, you can ask her if she's real because she was completely fake before. I, I, I don't know why. I have a very strong feeling I'm not going to be able to face these black knights and survive though. Like, because they are some terrifying bunch of people. This has got to be make it or break it time then, I, I suppose. Um, we'll let you save up here, just to be certain that we're not going to get screwed over. I'm just going to enter and get murdered instantly. So we cannot warp out of here. That is good to know, but also kind of terrible. Please don't be random monsters. Be actual soldiers. Or you could be random monsters. Like, I don't know. It just doesn't make sense to me. Like, I feel like there would be actual soldiers here, you know? Because it's a castle. The soldiers that took it before. It just makes too much sense. Maybe that's actually who the other, like, rebel forces are fighting. They're not fighting the Black Knights. They're fighting the soldiers. But then what happened to all the Black Knights? Um, hey. Hey, Leela. Are you, uh, are you, uh, enemy? Oh, nice. I'm okay with that. Lila joined the party. Good for her. Does she have plans to help? She does. Oh, she has one HP. Um, shoot. What happened to her? I'm actually kind of happy she's with me because she was actually somewhat useful. Wait, is it seriously just like this straightforward? If it is, that's really awesome. So I just get to pick and choose the battles I do. Very nice, very nice. Probably a bad idea to fight these people then. I don't know what Curse does, but it probably does something negative. Oh, shoot. Are they all at haste now? Oh, that's going to be a big problem. <laughs> I hope Aura Scroll is worth it. Because they are screwing me up. We got we got to lower the numbers real soon. See, that's a lot better. I can deal with one person with haste, not like four. I don't even know if haste did that much. He didn't. That wasn't like a weird like random like turns. I was just like, oh wow, they're doing the same exact thing they did before. Well, we already got Aura, so whatever. We got it from the chest, guys. Did we? I hope we did. What does Aura do? Figure it out, I guess. Yeah. It's like, it's just like a, eh. I like, it, it's a, can we not? Curse is a status ailment, come on. Unless do we have... Oh, Bassoon is so pointless, why did I even get it? Okay, well this is sad. I probably screwed up pretty royally. You know, we're just gonna... We're just gonna not worry about the chest. We don't want to get in random battles with enemies. My idea is maybe we'll, uh, shoot, that curse just, fuck, that's, that's, that's insane. Like, he's doing only 40-something damage. Like, that's really bad. Um, I'm thinking what I'll do is, sorry, I'm just watching Fury and now fail. I'll probably face the boss and then I'll go back for everything. The curse is just, he's useless now. Like, he's not... 
he's not useful at all. I might have to go back and go back to an inn or something because he is not... I don't want to face a boss and have that as my backup because he's just going to fail. Like, every time he... every chance he gets. I think I might have something to cure curse, actually. Because I think I had one just ran away in my inventory in case it happened. If I do, I'll cure curse on him and then sleep we let it die because she'll die in the boss fight. And then curse... Curse won't be an issue. But that took way too long. If we had Fury on at full, like, enable, like, capacity, he would have been able to just destroy the enemy. Done. Okay. Let's see what we got in our inventory to really cre uh, cure that business. Let's Cross, probably. Nullifies Curse. That's exactly what we need. Probably the only, yeah, that's the only cross we have. Oh well. Hey there, buddy. Oh, you have bosses next to you or enemies or something. Please don't inflict curse on me again. Oh, these ones don't matter. We'll see, we'll cut through these guys pretty quickly. Curse on Lee was still kind of annoying, though. Know? That's the one I'm seeing. I'm like, eh. I don't really want that to stay there, but it's not worth going all the way back for her. Because she can she can survive. Actually the idea is she won't survive and she'll die and then we'll actually want to deal with curse, but I mean she dies a lot enough she she dies enough to where I it makes sense it would happen. So we got a lot of upgrades there. And we can talk to uh, the green bomber man. Is he, is he a T-Rex? He just growled at me. He is a T-Rex if I've ever seen one. Alright, cool. So, pretty much the same exact start that we always do. We're going to try to berserk. Um on early on just so we don't have to deal with the whole like oh we can't hit for enough damage situation perfect that actually worked really well uh, so well we're gonna try to preserve him too oh my god this is, he's doing exactly what I need him to do this is awesome like this could not have gone better That's, this is insane random Random chance. Uh, that's a little bit much, but you know, that gives us time to cure Leela. Uh, we'll hit him twice again, and then hopefully end the fight. And if that's the case, like we've we've won. And we we'll even use cure on Leela just just to uh, get our magic up. I don't know if we'll actually have time to do it. We might end this pretty soon. Here too. And that probably won't help her if she gets hit. 90 actually might, honestly. Dude, that was definition of perfect battle based on luck. Like, that was insane. Like, we could have done that all day. Okay, okay. Dude, I'll go all the way to Mist City if you need me to. I actually want me to ask about Mist City. Where is it? You gonna tell me? Wait, what did you say? Go down to the castle's base level to find the white mask. I would tell you the major.
Oh, well that's not helpful. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, so, cool. So I think we, uh, we learned everything we can from them. Now we gotta go to Mysidia. Did we just needlessly get into battles? Watch me, have, if a monster appears, I'm just gonna call race. If this doesn't make any sense. I'll uh, we'll just heal him. It's kind of a waste because we can just go to an inn, but what's in here? We're in the fucking... Come on, guys. This doesn't make any sense. Why are monsters suddenly appearing when we've already cleared out the castle? Like, wouldn't that not make sense? I don't know. Just call me crazy, though. That was pretty critical. We took each and one enemy out for each person. That, that hasn't happened in a while, actually. Normally, it's Fury and Gus just hammering away on them. It's surprising. But in a good way. Now, if random enemies, enemies just appear, that's going to be annoying. Because we really did clear out the castle. We should have people patrolling and stuff. Okay, so more gill. Um, no enemies, probably because we had already, um, like, that's far enough to where we would get random encounters. Wait, underneath this castle? Okay, okay. It's always cool. Cool things to grab, of course. All of me, what the fuck is that shit? What are you talking about, you person? We're never gonna check this out, though. So there's nothing here yet. Um, don't tell me how to live my life. Carry everything I want, man. Doom, that is wicked. Definitely want to equip Doom. Doom's messed up. Start making Therion learn all the spells we can't give uh, freaking Maria there. I just hate that I didn't plan that out. Because I figured she can learn every magic spell. But I was wrong. It's okay though. I think she learned the pivotal ones. Life, Warp, Cure. That's the one she really needs to learn. I'm, get, I'm, I'm asking the mirror things? This doesn't make any sense. Hmm. this castle. Okay, I'm okay with that. That might be good for us. We might be able to find something new. Uh, the question is how to get underneath the castle. I'm assuming it starts on the first floor, though. Oh, which we are on. Okay, that's not, that's no hope. I should actually check out inside Castle Finn to see if anything's changed, because I'm sure a lot has changed. Hmm. So, it's obviously like the sides we're not really getting to. So the question is, is if there's staircases we can use down here. Hopefully there would be, but I don't see any. This is going to be a little bit tricky.
Remember, there's always a way, guys. Always a way. Don't know what way that is, but there's gotta be a way. Maybe I didn't explore the Hall of Mirrors enough. I mean, it looks like I pretty much know where everything is. Like, camera angle fits perp uh, perfectly with it. So nothing there. Yeah, there's nothing in the castle. Not that I can see, at least. But anyways, our little exploration will probably end the video there. Uh, and when we come back, we'll check out all this business with the city and see what's going on. As always, though, seriously, guys, thank you for watching. Um, have a great day, and don't want to check out the vote form below. That's going to be the main thing to do. We'll see you guys later. Bye.